So, you want to learn how to bizarre flip? Bizarre flipping is widely regarded as the best way to make money. And if you know how, then it can actually make more money than zealot grinding. Of course, with this video, you're going to learn how to do it well, so be sure to watch through uh, in order to not miss a single tip or cool website. Okay, so the basics. This is the bazaar, this is a sell offer, and this is a buy offer. And this lets you offer coins to sell or buy your items. Got it? Got it. If you click here, you get access to these absolutely fucking useless drafts, of which the one we drafts do not work. <laughs> From here, it helps to press the escape key on your keyboard and make your way over to bazaartracker.com. Free download, no virus, working new 2020. This website features tons of useful stuff about bazaar flipping in real time. Once you're on this website, make your way over to the margins tab, not margins percentage. You'll be greeted by a page full of information and numbers. The most important number here is margin. The margin is the difference between the sell and buy prices of an item, and as a result, is the profit you can make for each order. And the percentage next to that is the margin as a percentage of the buy price. By clicking this tab, you sort all of the items in order from highest to lowest margin. So great, the highest margin items are the best to trade, right? This is the first big mistake every new flipper makes. High margins do not mean good flips. Pay attention to these two values, buy and sell volume. The buy volume is the number of buy offers made in one hour, and the sell volume is the number of sell offers made in a day. Take a look at this blaze rod. Although the margin is high at 80,000 per item, this won't be exact because this script was recorded like 12 hours before the video, there are quite literally 1,000 times more buy offers than sell offers, meaning if you were to place a buy offer for this item, you would get barely any sales because only 250 people are actually insta-selling this item per day versus 265,000 people insta-buying. As a result, it's worth scrolling down the list until you find an item with a decent margin and similar buy and sell volumes. These are sometimes easier to find using the profit margins percentage tab. Here's a good one right now. Decent margin, relatively high and similar sales volume. I'll write this down to use for future reference. Oh also, make sure to subscribe if you haven't already to make sure that you'll be the first to watch our juicy money making tutorials in the future. The bazaar is a volatile market and prices change all the time with supply and demand. As a result, items you decide to flip are not consistent and change all the time, with some margins randomly opening and closing for no real reason whatsoever. You also have to keep checking before starting a new flip to make sure if an item is still worthwhile. So now you know what to flip, it's time to place your buy offer and go do something else, right? Wrong. You aren't the only bizarre flipper who notices this margin, and you aren't the only one looking for some easy coins, so it's time to start placing a lot of offers. Withdraw as many coins as you want, the more the better, see how many you can buy with that amount of coins, and place your first buy offer using the plus zero one of top price option. Now it's time to stop regular skyblock and start rank competitive skyblock. Every 30 seconds, Remove your past buy offer and replace it again with the plus 0.1 option every 30 seconds until your money runs out. The margin lowers below 5% or it's been longer than 15 minutes of doing this. In between putting up offers, put up a sell offer of any items you manage to claim with your many buy offers using the minus 0.1 option and keep doing this with your offers. The margin percentage value on the website is also a rough guide to profit so if you successfully invest into a flip, you can expect to earn that percentage back at the end. So that was basic bizarre flipping. Let's get dangerous and consider some more risky but wildly profitable alternative flips. If you are interested in getting into more advanced flips, I'll leave this cool discord server where people discuss amazing new flips they are just found. And I'll also include our own discord server cause we got this super cool custom link now. The first risky flip you could try is predicting updates, and I've already made a video about that and if you're interested in that, it's on screen now. But the second risky flip you could try is predicting the market. Some items have very specific times that they're needed, such as candies in the spooky event or items used to buy Oringo's pets. You can see that these drafts go up and down, and this lines up with the times these events come and go. If you prefer a less involved method, or want to invest your money instead of letting it rot in the bank, 
place a bid on these items about 2 hours after the event ends and sell the items during or just before the event for some really easy money. Ah, uh, well look at you. You now know how to bizarre flip and are ready to be another competitor to the bizarre flippers out there. Be sure to join the flippers community in the description and subscribe to make our Hypixel names red.